Uh, so, hey, Nice. What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing, actually. I'm just sitting here, but. You want to summon the R34? Huh? You want to summon the R34 already? That's probably not going to happen for a while, but. Well, what's a while? Like a week or two. Okay. Yeah, look, I can't control it, man. Okay. So I still love you. Don't worry. I know you feel like spinning. I'm sorry, but. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yeah, the phone call made it 10 times worse. It's just, it's literally like, it's like, you know, when you know you've done something wrong and you're trying to like, you're trying to like fix your steps and like you're trying to cover. It's like, it's like basically when somebody murders somebody, like somebody kills somebody and they're trying to clean up their mess. They're trying to, they're trying to like get the blood stains out and they're trying to use that bleach to clean those blood stains, but they forgot that one fingerprint and the cops got that fingerprint. And now they're trying to figure out a way why their fingerprint is there. And they're coming up with a hundred thousand excuses on why that one fingerprint was left on the crime scene. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hi, Uncle Auntie. Where's the Uncle wow. Tommy? Uh, he went with the six day charger. Yeah. Huh? Hello. What's up? Can you see if I need a repair, brother? Not really, I guess not. Jeez, this thing's never breaks. Yo, of the wolf coming out. What happened? Said so you don't drive it hard enough then. Did you stall at any point? Do you want a body engine? Uh, no, no. I, I, I drive this thing into the ground. I don't, I don't know what the fuck happens, but no, it's good. I'm chilling. Right. Yo, wolf, thank you so much for the five gift and the active text. They've been 18 months. Rambo, thank you for the brand new tier one. Neela! Holy fuck! Neela, where the fuck have you been? Uh, yo, chat, can everybody say hi to Neela? DK, please. Neela has been part of this community for I can't tell you how long. And I miss her. How are you doing? Are you OOC mad? Like, I like XQC, but I also watch just as much as Rami doesn't. Uh, no, I, I, I don't give a fuck. I am not OOC mad. The only thing I get mad of is the Chad Hoppers. The Chad Hoppers is what gets me fueled, right? And that's and that's a downfall of me, right? I get mad from Chad Hoppers. I ain't mad about what's going on in game. I could give two fucks. I could give two fucks what's going on in game. I don't care. Chat, because when I finish my stream, RP is the last thing I'm thinking of, my dudes. After I'm done with my stream, it literally, it, I don't, I don't even want to know RP after I'm done streaming. I could give two fucks. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> literally, I don't care. My dude. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Yo, Jerino, thank you so much for the 420, baby. I appreciate you. What the fuck is this? My dude. <laughs> He's just saying my dude. <laughs> like I said, man, I love I love the storyline. I I love the build up. I love what XQC is doing. You know, creating more storyline. Obviously, they want to have a little fun with it. Just don't make it toxic, man. That's all we ask for. And I've seen a lot of dumb comments. Here's another thing, right? I've seen, I seen a lot of dumb comments from people. Who is Vinny to say that they're going to start at the top up going after CB? You know what I find so cringe? Hold on, let me pull over because this car is so fucking loud. Okay, let, let, let me let me talk a minute, okay? Because I want to school you dumb fucks for a little bit, okay? Let me school y'all for a second, okay? Y'all are like, yo, why are you going to go at... Why is Vinny saying they're going to go after CB? Oh, fuck Vinny. CB has nothing to do with it. Everybody was so happy when Mr. K told Lang Buddha that, oh, this is the way it's going to go down from now on. If they fuck up, we're coming after y'all. All of yous were so hyped for that. Oh my God, Mr. K, you're a god for saying that. Yeah, you know what? It, it, it's going to be collateral damage. And, and oh my God, you're amazing for saying that, right? Everybody, everybody forgot that. 
everybody forgot that Mr. K said that, right? All of y'all forgot. And that's the reason why Vinny said what he said is because he remembers when fucking Mr. K told Lang Buddha that if XQC and the Gulag gang do some dumb shit, CB is going to be collateral damage, right? But all of y'all fucking forget. And right away, you want to shit on other people, meaning me, because, because I said it. But when Mr. K said it, everything was fine and dandy, right? Everything was fine and dandy when Mr. K told Lang Booty he's going to be collateral damage the next time that fucking GG fuck up. Right? Y'all forget. Y'all are so invested in RP, but forget the most important points about it. Yo, Mr. Danky, thank you for the 30 months. New coming in with a thousand biddies, baby. Yeah, I slept good. I slept like for four hours. Woke up. Uh, woke up, had some coffee, had a yogurt. Went, I brought Louie outside. We were playing around. Uh, turkeys came in my backyard. Louie started chasing the turkeys. The turkeys started chasing Louie. I had an eventful morning this morning. I was laughing my ass off. Because it was funny watching Louie chasing the turkeys. And then the turkeys turning around when more turkeys came. And they started chasing Louie. It was fun. It was. It, I had a great morning. You see right there, you see these dumb comments? You see these dumb comments right here? Apocalypse. Okay, Apocalypse. Where are you? K always coming back to some spice. Hold on, no, somebody else said something dumb. Hold on. Somebody just said, always when Mr. K's not around, war starts. Tell me, did Chain Gang do anything to break this war out? Because this is the shit that Rami was getting shit about. This is the shit that Rami was getting heat for. Did Chain Gang do anything? For making this war happen with GG. Yes or no? Thank you. She a little diamond. How's my D2 experience going? It's on hold. It's on hold right now because it, we're doing the boomerathon. CG did nothing to start this war. End the story. <clears throat> You're gonna miss the raid, bro. No, I'll be good. I'll, I'll, I'll try to do some. I'll, I'll start. I'll try, I'll try playing a little. Wait, hold on. Yo, strong creatures. Explain yourself. Sorry, but that's a lie. So, strong creatures. I, chat, can we all put put a hold? I want everybody to stop talking. Strong creatures. Exactly explain. Explain to me how that's a lie, strong creatures. Explain to me how that's a lie. Can everybody just stop talking? I want. I want to get. I want to get his. Uh, I want to get his explanation on why that's a lie. <laughs> CG has robbed X and Marty worth 1.4 million. Okay. Okay. You're talking about six months ago. You're talking about in between these six months when GG's back was against the wall and CB's back was against the wall. All of a sudden, they're sucking CG's dick and they need stuff from Vinny, right? Because they want to do the casino and they want to complete the casino acting fake as fuck and being like, oh my God, you're the best and thank you so much. Thank you for doing this for us. You're, you're amazing. I, I, we appreciate this so much. We appreciate you helping us, right? That happened six months ago, but, but when they want to be your friend, they will, right? But all of a sudden now something comes up from six months ago, right? And didn't, didn't CG already fight that war when it happened six months ago with GG? And didn't it stop when we all went at war with the cops? Didn't, didn't we already go to war about the, the lower vault and then it stopped because we started mag dumping the cops and it was hell week on cops and XQC said it himself that we need to start doing things together and not fighting one another. Yeah. Yeah. So explain to me a little more. Explain to me a little more. Tell me, please. But honestly, you think X and Marty forgot about the 1.4 million after you breached them. 
yeah it's six months ago if that's what you're holding on to if that if that's what you're holding on to after six months man man let me tell you <laughs> let me tell you dude <laughs> let me tell you 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 need you need to be thinking a lot more <laughs> <laughs> Benny, stop. You're speaking too many facts. You know what's funny? All I'm doing is speaking facts, and then you have dumb fucks in chat. <laughs> then you're surprised you get death threats. Listen, one thing 